Hi everyone, welcome to the Synthesizer V user group. This is a quick video to show you how to use Synthesizer V, also known as Synth V, as a multi out plugin within Ableton Live. Using Synth V in this way means that you can route each voice from within a single instance of the plugin to individual Ableton tracks. You can then apply effects to each voice separately. Please note that you only get the VSTI plugin with the professional version of Synth V. The free basic version of Synth V does not come with this VST plugin. Okay, here I have a very simple Ableton project with one instance of a Synth V VST plugin in track one. Within the Synth V plugin, you can see I have three tracks, each using a different voice and singing different words. For the purposes of this demo, I just have each track singing a number one, two, and three. Now, if I play this project in the default setup, Synth V outputs all three voices to track one like this. One, two, three, one, two, three. Believe me, that gets pretty boring to hear after a while. If we want to output the audio from each track within the Synth V plugin to separate tracks in Ableton, we need to make a few changes. Firstly, within Synth V, we need to change the global setting for audio channel layout to track combined. This outputs each Synth V track as a separate audio output to Ableton. By default, the track in Ableton running the VST will now output voice one, one as you can hear. One, one, then we need to make a few changes within Ableton. To hear the other voices in separate tracks, we need to create an audio track in Ableton for each additional voice in Synth V. As you can see, I have already created two additional audio tracks in Ableton. To get these tracks to use the audio from Synth V, we must change the audio sources for each track in Ableton. From the Audio From dropdown, select Synthesizer V Studio plugin as the input type. Then change the input channel to Output 2, Output 3 and so on. Just to be clear, Output 2 will input Synth Voice 2 so that you will hear Synth Voice 2 on that track. Output 3 will input Synth Voice 3 into that track. You need to do this for each additional track. So for three Synth V voices, as in this example, I need a total of three tracks. Make sure each track is enabled. Make sure the monitor inputs are set to in. Now you should hear each voice play through a different track. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Thanks for listening. I hope you found this helpful.